life of someone that you know, and not being dramatic because we're shopping for the EV Rider Mobility Scooter. So think about where you're not going, where someone you love is not going. Could it be that big family wedding, the family reunion, all of those major life events that you wanna be at, the graduation? But it could also be those small everyday moments. So maybe it's just going around your neighborhood to check out the scenery, see the leaves changing colors. Maybe it's just a doctor's appointment or the grocery store. We're talking about getting your yes back, but also getting your independence back. And not just with any mobility scooter. The EV Rider is really the top of the line when it comes to mobility scooters. You get a two-way throttle. I can control this forward and backward with one finger. I don't have to worry about braking. It has a soft brake system, so I'm gonna come to a soft, gentle stop no matter what I do. You get a horn. You also get LED lights so that people can see when you're coming. I just turn my lights on and off so you can see, but others can see you coming if it's a little dark outside. You get your keys, and then this model has auto fold. So it's gonna fold up for you on its own so you can take it any and everywhere because it will fit in your car, in the trunk or in the back seat. So it's gonna be ready for all of those adventures from now throughout the fall and the winter. And we have a savings right now of $266 off of our usual QVC price. So as we dive into the features and what really makes EV mobility scooters the top of the line, keep in mind that we've got a featured price that's gonna save you $266. And then keep in mind that we have a couple color choices to shop for as well. I am going to be riding on the sapphire blue this hour, but we do have two other options available for you. Here's a look at your gold. It's called Jupiter Gold. And then we also have your red. V45377 is your item number. Free shipping and handling. And here at QVC, you can also take advantage of 18 month special financing if you're shopping with your QVC credit card. And when you look at our featured price and you spread it out over 18 months, you're at about $148 per month. And if you don't have a QVC credit card, but you're like 18 month special financing sounds really good. If you sign up today, you get your new scooter home, you're gonna get a $60 account credit to use toward a future purchase. I can't do this hour alone. We're gonna welcome in Denise Repko. She is a health and wellness expert and she brings us EV Rider Mobility Scooters here at QVC. Denise, <laughs> it's always good to see you. Welcome in. Oh, thank you so much. Good to see you too, Vanessa. And I think, you know, there's so much that I love about this scooter. First of all, it's so easy to use, but it's a really high quality scooter. Uh, very, very safe, but this particular one is state-of-the-art in technology, and it comes to your home fully assembled out of the box. But I don't want you to blink, because this is the magic of what this scooter does to you. You literally, my friend, push a button, and it folds all by itself. It only weighs 51.8 pounds, but then you push a button again, and it unfolds and it holds up to a 250 pound person. So it truly doesn't get any easier or any more elegant or fancy, or again, state of the art. And it's fully assembled when it comes to you. So a lot of instant gratification right here. And Denise, I can go anywhere and everywhere because of the way EV motor scooters are designed. Like I can get around a table like this and I can make mm -hmm. those turns. So I don't have to worry about carpet. I don't have to worry about not being able to get the turn right. I don't have to worry about braking. I can take my hands off and I come yeah. to a soft, gentle stop each time. Yeah, and that's called our electromagnetic braking system. And that's important for so many people, especially our seniors who might have dexterity issues or hand-eye coordination problems or maybe don't know exact, uh, the exact amount of brake to apply if you're talking about a braking system that requires you to squeeze. This just requires you to let go of the throttle. And that stop is just about instantaneous, but it's very smooth and not abrupt. So you never have to worry about how much pressure do I apply? What if I forgot to, where the brake is? What if I don't use it in time? None of that's a factor here. You just let go of that throttle, which by the way, you can use it on the right hand or the left hand. 
and you come to that very smooth, balanced, and steady stop. Denise, can we talk about the controls? Because sometimes, you know, even if you drive someone else's car, right? You're like, how do I work the windshield wipers? How do I work the, the high beam? Sometimes you're true, driving right? with the high beams on. You're like, I don't know how to turn them off. When I get this right? home, how do I know what does what? I feel like it's pretty easy to operate. You, you kind of made it easy for us. It really is. It's very intuitive. So when you look at the dashboard, great shot, you guys, you'll put the key in. We give you two keys and that key fob is attached. You put the key in and turn it to the right. Instantly, you'll see your battery display illuminate. And that's going to happen your very first time because we do put some charge in the battery for you when you get it home. So you'll give it a test drive, but then you're going to want to plug it in for four to six hours. That will give you a full charge that can take you up to nine miles or two hours of continuous use. Now, right below the key is that really big headlight, two big headlights, should I say. And you get tail lights as well. And that's a simple rocker switch. But, you know, I'm so used to being automatic pilot telling people, you can be seen, you can be seen. People see you coming and going. But you're so right. This is meant for the rider to see what's ahead of them as well. And I always forget to mention that. How silly of me. But you also get that horn, and that horn is another safety feature. And then your speed dial. So this goes up to four miles per hour. And you can change that speed at any time during the driving process. And we already went over that throttle, dual throttle system. You can, with just a little pressure of an index finger, pull the red lever and you're going forward, push it with that same index finger and you're going reverse. But if you only have a good, strong or dominant left hand, you pull the black lever on the left side to go in reverse or push it to go forward. And of course, we were over the electromagnetic braking system. You just let go of the throttle and it comes to that smooth stop. You even have some adjustability in the tiller. So if you have someone with longer legs, you can accommodate them by lifting that tiller a little higher or lowering it down. And this actually does have a little extra leg room too and a little bar in the front that allows you to extend your legs and keep your feet nice and relaxed. It's carpeted. I know you just said the, the dashboard, but since I'm on that tour, I might as well tell people the carpeting yeah. is removable. So if you spill something on it or get it muddy or dirty or whatever the case may be, it's like a new closure. So you can just pull it off, rinse it under the sink or hose it off, and then just put it back down. But just super comfortable. Your wheels, you see there's a wheel at each corner of the base. This gives you the utmost in balance and stability. That's a beautiful shot. And those wheels are solid. They're not air filled, so you're never going to get a flat tire. The seat that Vanessa's sitting on is curved and contoured. So you saw that little contour on the side and a little slope down the front. That's fantastic because if you're sitting in the chair, it's not cutting into the back of your legs at a 90 degree angle. It's sloped and it actually almost cradles your bottom. So really everything about this scooter is meant for your comfort, your safety, but more importantly, your independence, your dignity, and your ability to get yourself on your time frame from one place to the next. And Denise, we don't have to worry about going somewhere and hoping that there is a scooter available, hoping that maybe you can rent one, hoping that it's charged, that it has a braking system that you can operate, mm -hmm. a throttle that you can operate, that you feel safe on it. This, you take where you want to go. So if it's a doctor's appointment, a dentist appointment, a wedding, a family reunion, whatever it is, this is your yes mobile and you are taking mm -hmm. it to all of those events because I can put it in my car. That's exactly right. Because it weighs 51.8 pounds, it's manageable. Um, I tell people, well, even our lightest weight scooter, Vanessa, that we bring to QVC is 45 pounds. So this is only five pounds more than that. Um, so not, not too, too shabby, you know, manageable. You don't need a special car or vehicle or truck. If you have a car with a back seat, a four door car, you can put this in the back seat instead of lifting it up into the trunk. That's what I always do when I'm traveling with my dad because it, I don't have to lift it as high. The trunk is a higher lift. So I just put it in the back seat and yeah, we go to doctor's appointments. We go to the grocery store, but we also do bigger fun things, family things like you know, going to an Eagles game, tailgating, a lot of fun there, out to dinner, movies, concerts. He's, he's come to things with my granddaughters, you know, dance recitals, karate belt training, you know, all the fun things that otherwise he'd be sitting home and not having a good time. His quality of life kind of 
goes back and forth. But and I heard you say this, this is life changing. When you get something like this and you feel independent and you've got dignity and autonomy, it does change how you feel about life, which changes how you feel about yourself. And it could just be so empowering to say yes, to go and do and feel like you're alive again. And Denise, I mean, that's what it's all about. It's all about like the big things. I think that's what we think about a lot of times. Like, what if I couldn't go to the wedding or to the family reunion? Yeah. But it's the little things. Like, what if I just want to go around my neighborhood and take a look at the Christmas lights, you know, when December rolls yeah. around? Or what if I just want to see the fall foliage? Or what if I just kind of want to meet a friend at a restaurant because I can pull up to a table and now this is my seat and I can just turn to the side and now I can be at the coffee shop or the restaurant with my friend. Yeah. And so sometimes I feel like we think about the big events that of course we want to be in the pictures, we want to be in the celebrations, but what about those little things every single day that you're like, uh, you know what, I think I'll pass. I think I'll pass on this. I think I'll pass on that. All those little things I think are the moments that make life really rich. And now we're a part of those little everyday moments. It's so true, and you can do all of it, no matter what it is, because this makes you feel like, number one, those wheels act as your legs, and they become your legs, and they're never gonna go flat, and you're never in a panic. If you've ever been with someone who has mobility issues, and they are attempting to walk, and they all of a sudden realize they can't go any further, and they need to sit down immediately, that can be terrifying. That can give you such anxiety and fear, but not gonna happen on your EV rider because your seat is always with you. So you'll never be out and thinking, that's it, I have to sit now, what am I gonna do? Am I gonna fall? How am I gonna be able to get back up? Not gonna happen because this takes the fear, the anxiety away, makes it easy and effortless. And all you have to do is keep charge in the battery and then decide where it is you wanna go. Where we going and Denise not only where are we going but what I love about EV Rider is that you give us rides that we want to be on you know you give us a scooter that we're like yeah I'm saying yes but I feel really good at what I'm riding into the event on you get to choose your color whether you like the sapphire blue that I'm on Denise is in that red and they all have that hint of metallic in them as well so really pick up the color that's gonna make you say yes the most that you're gonna be most excited to get out there and do something new on. And then we also have Jupiter Gold as well. There's a Jupiter Gold, it's very popular, but it's our most limited option. And then we have that red that Denise has been riding on. The 45377 is that item number. And then Denise, what I think is the coolest thing about this one <laughs> is the autofold. To me, it's like a convertible. Like everyone's gonna For be looking sure. at you like, whoa, hold up. Like when you drop the top on a convertible, that is what to me right? equals the autofold. <laughs> That's it. And it's as easy as this, Vanessa. Don't blink because I'm literally just pushing a button on the key fob that we provide for you. And this folds. And I was just uh, talking with Dan Hughes a few hours ago. And I think this takes like 15 or 20 seconds to completely fold and then completely unfold. So here's what I want to tell people. When you do fold it, there's a little handle there. You upright it. And I tell you to upright it because it's easier to wheel it somewhere uh, if you're especially if you're conserving the battery power but if you're storing it you can wheel it to a closet wheel it to a garage or wheel it to the car to put it in but then when you want to go to unfold it most important thing you need to remember is lay it flat you always want to open up your scooter from the flat position because if you do start to open and hit that key fob green when it's in the upright position it'll start to open up and then it's going to Kerplunk. And just about every person who has owned the scooter or tried the scooter has done that one time. And you only need to make that mistake once and, and then you'll, you'll realize it. But there's also uh, buttons on the back, a red and a green button. So if you uh, don't want to use your key fob, you can just push the button down here too. And, and to note, if you are in your scooter and you have your keys in there, Nobody can push a button and start to fold it on you because it will not fold and unfold with the key in the ignition, if you will. You must take the key out and then use that key fob, pressing red or green, or 
those buttons red or green, but it will not fold if you are sitting in it with the key and the ignition. Oh, that's good to know. And I mean, look yeah. at how easy it is to be able to fold and unfold because I mean, I think that's the thing sometimes, Denise, that can kind of stress us out the most is like, how do yeah. I get it unfolded? How do I get yeah. it folded? My sister left my niece's stroller here. It's still unfolded in my garage because I have no idea how to fold it up. I mean, it's things like that that you're like, how do I do it? It's the press totally. of a button. So now, 